Okay, hey, like, let me have my first play. Is it? Honestly, very scary in like a unreal way because like why am I 20 when I'm literally 16? Like I'm literally still just a girl. <laughs> Anyways, today we have a bunch of errands to do because tomorrow I'm having a little party, get together type thing where my family is coming over, we're gonna have cake, we're gonna chill, relax, be around each other, which I'm really um, sort of excited about. I feel most comfortable around them. Oh my gosh, why is my shoulder hurting? Uh, I have a list of things that I, need, that I need to do. I'm a Virgo, of course, so. But first I want to talk about how I feel turning 21. It's such a weird age, like, when I turned 18, it was like people were telling me I was a grown-up and I still felt like a kid. Now I'm like, I have to be a grown-up. I, I adult, you know, I do adulting things. I talk to important people. I set things up. I have bills. I am responsible for a lot of things. But I think the struggle within getting those things done and the frustration that's what makes me feel like a kid that's what makes me feel like i'm not an adult like i'm not up to speed especially like the socializing aspect of being an adult like the having to deal with other people for literally anything for the smallest thing like calling people to set up wi-fi i don't know i just don't like talking to people i don't know if any of that makes sense but 21 is scary also i just heard txt are performing at the vmas I think I'm getting too much food, but um, I will force everyone to take it home with them. I just want a platter so really pretty. That's my goal. Yep. <laughs> Is there any way I could zoom it in? Wow, 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 wow. Oh. <laughs> Everyone's hating on Somi's new song, Gold. I got a lot of gum 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 Oh my gosh. I am gonna play I want this album so bad. It's in the closet. And this G hole. Love you. I love you. Mm, yeah, love her. Honestly, I couldn't really vlog because I was really irritated. Um, I want to get as much as done as I can today because I don't want to wake up tomorrow and be stressed out on my birthday. Like, I gotta hurry, I gotta hurry, I gotta hurry. I don't want to be working on it. Wow, people are getting here. Anyway, let me show you a couple of the things that I got. Candles, pink ones, because I really love pastel colors. I told everyone to wear yellow. They don't wear yellow. <laughs> They're going to suffer a horrible fate. So yeah, my theme is just like pastel colors and like, I guess like picnic vibes? I don't know. I have a lot planned. Not a lot planned, but I have more than I've ever done for my birthday plan before. <clears throat> okay. I need to change the water of these flowers. Oh my gosh, they're not doing well. They're not doing as well as my last ones were. I don't know why. I love you. I love you. I love you. You're amazing, you're growing, you're awesome, you're slayful. Please, please, please. It makes me sad. Come back. Come back. Womp womp. 
My siblings just came out here and started annoying me. So I guess I'm still irritated. I just need my alone time, you know? I'm an introvert. Anyways, let's get to work. I put a mask on because I'm not feeling well and I'm gonna disinfect the tables that I just did. It's not COVID or anything, but the girls were sick a couple of days ago. It's like a cold or something. And I thought I was good because they recovered and I was fine. I don't want to risk it, so. It doesn't taste bad, it doesn't really taste like anything, it's just the smells I do. Yay! I'm turning 12. <laughs> My Nana got me these flowers and these balloons. I'm very thankful. Anyways, I'm pretty much done setting up the cakes here. I'll show you guys. When it comes to decorating for my birthday get together, I wanted to originally not put much thought into it, not put much effort into it, because for whatever reason, for like majority of my life, I never liked my birthday. It wasn't something I ever really looked forward to. It was something I felt embarrassed about. I didn't want to plan anything. I didn't want to ask people to plan anything. This year, I think something changed and it was the simple fact that simply as I've gotten older, I've gained more confidence in myself. The people that I care about the most, like I want them there with me on my birthday. I want to make my birthday a day that is good for myself and a day that makes me happy. So I want my people there. So I disregarded any scared or negative feelings that I had in the past and was like, okay, let me have my birthday. Like, let me have my birth slay. Like, let me have my birth slay. <laughs> hey, where the party at though? Where the party at? So first thing I did was hop on Pinterest because like I'm a girl and girls hop on Pinterest. For so long now, I've really admired the different aesthetics of like cafes in Korea. I love how a lot of them display their sweets and their pastries and stuff like that. A lot of the cafes in Korea have this very cozy feel and aesthetic. Genuinely cozy, like some themes, some cafes look like if like your grandma opened a cafe and it looks so casual and it's still aesthetically pleasing but also like really pretty and everything's displayed. All the labels are like handwritten and it's just so pretty. And I wanted to carry that vibe over to my decorations and just It started raining really quickly but it stopped. Do you have any tips for making mac and cheese? To me? Yeah. <laughs> Are you camera shy? Yes. So you're not going to tell me your tips? I mean... <laughs> you're silly. And make sure you add enough salt and pepper. I don't know. Just do my thing. Deja, I'm your big sister. I can't wait for you to be born. I think you're gonna be a girl. <laughs> like it's a gender reveal? <laughs>
soon as they left my energy is like I had fun but I need to like get a good night's rest I didn't play as much Fortnite as I wanted to <laughs> but my brother played on my PlayStation and he got battle royale victory battle royale so <clears throat> very happy for him I'm happy for your brother um, we completed like most of the missions I don't feel like talking. <laughs> you can turn the screen around. Okay. About a week prior to my birthday, I decided that I wanted to visit the botanical garden, either on the morning of my birthday or on the day after. But of course, things don't always go as planned, so. After a couple of days of being sick in bed, which that was horrible, and then a couple of more days of literally just not wanting to leave the house, I finally find myself at a botanical garden. This doesn't come as a surprise at all, but I've only visited a couple of botanical gardens. The thing is, I always find myself wanting to go back, and I wonder if that's because of where I was raised. For anyone that doesn't know, I was raised in the Everglades, so I grew up playing outside. I grew up seeing animals, you know, alligators and different types of bugs and I was surrounded by trees and it was very warm. But of course, like anyone else, like most people, as I grew older, I became less connected with outside. They could be instruments. I went in nature less often and I found myself more on social media. Perhaps that's why I felt like going to a botanical garden was something I wanted to do when I turned 21. It definitely wasn't a conscious decision to go to a botanical garden with the idea of like connecting with my younger self and feeling young again through experiencing nature. But I wonder if it's like something that was subconscious. Maybe I'm crazy and I'm dramatic, but as I'm reviewing the footage and I'm reliving how I was feeling, I just wonder if that's a subconscious decision that I made. Obviously it's not outlandish for me to want to go to a botanical garden, but you know, a little introspection never hurt anybody. Like I said earlier in the video, I don't necessarily fully feel 21. It's sort of a weird feeling. I'm sure a lot of people feel the same way. Actually, I know that a lot of people feel the same way. I don't want to shut out the parts of myself that exist in me from being a child once. I find that to be cruel and unnecessary. But I also don't want to succumb to immature mindsets and being stuck. So, the introduction of being 21 has allowed me to think about the importance of allowing both parts of myself to exist. No, it's like a, a jungle, a jungle gym playground thing. Uh-uh. I'll go before you. How about okay, you? yeah, go before me. Why is it scary? Children do this, right? Yeah. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> Can you get my water bottle if I throw over there? Oh crap. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> 